And the Blount County Sheriff's Office is continuing to investigate a brush fire at a Louisville business. We have been following the situation at Petrie Arbor Lawn and Landscape all day long for you. Several fire departments responding to the scene, containing the flames mostly to the business's property this afternoon. At one point, a voluntary evacuation was put in place for people in a two-mile radius of the business. A reverse 911 warning was also sent out. Now, no injuries were reported, but the business's office building, warehouse, and some equipment were all burned. Now, at the fire's height, a trains were even stopped, and several roads had to be closed. The last of those closed roads reopening within just the last few hours. Also, keep in mind, due to our dry conditions, as of today, you need a burn permit for all open-air outdoor fires. These burn permits usually needed starting mid-October, but they are required early this season because of the dry weather. Now, permits are typically needed through mid-May and can be obtained for free as long as you are making a fire less than eight feet by eight feet. Meanwhile, there are several areas in here in East Tennessee that are under different forms of burn bans. We do have a complete list for you under the As Seen On section of WATE.com.